Hi all folks, this is Max from TransformerPrimeRoot.com um, So I'm going to show you how to install Transformer Prime Root drivers uh, or Transformer uh, drivers So download Transformer Prime Driver uh, .zip and you, if you unzip it um, you'll find a bunch of files and this is basically drivers for Windows For Mac and uh, Linux you don't need it So go to a control panel and then a hardware and sound um, device manager and then you'll see um, Asus Android composite device and make sure um, on your Android transformer uh, USB debugging is checked on it's under settings developer options for ICS and also um, for honeycomb it should be under settings um, applications development options um, so Make sure USB debugging checked on and you'll get this Asus Android composite device that comes on there. See that there? And uh, simply double click it and hit update driver. Browse my computer for driver software. Um, and then let me pick from a list of drivers on my computer. And then show, click, uh, show all devices, click next. And then uh, say have disk and then hit browse. And then go to the directory where you unzip the files to. So I have it in my desktop transformer prime driver. Um, click the Android underscore winusb.env. Open. OK. Um, you'll see that Asus Android composite ADB device right there. And hit click next. And uh, install this driver anyway. Choose that. And uh, you should be good to go. Um, so there you go. You should get Android. Um, don't worry about the Samsung Android phone just because I have other drivers. Just worry that you have the, as long as the Android composite ADV device comes up, you're all good to go. And uh, if you want to root your um, Transformer Prime, um, don't forget to check out my site, uh, transform, transformerprimeroot.com, um, where I have all kinds of hacks, tips, and cool stuff. Anyway, that's how you install um, Transformer Prime Windows drivers. For Linux and Mac, you don't need to install drivers. Thanks, y'all, and subscribe. See y'all later.